Tammy Carr. Jeremy Carr. Welcome to Trucking with the Cars. Today we're coming to you live from inside the truck and in the seat where most of the work happens. Uh, look, Tammy and I believe in working out outside with the fresh air, with sunshine, uh, and being on our feet, moving the way our body naturally is supposed to be moved. But today we're going to show you two exercises that we're going to do in the truck that are going to strengthen our back help support our posture because we sit in this seat way too many hours a day. In the seat, we can adjust our seat, we can uh, adjust our steering wheel and get into proper position to help our posture, help us start our day and stay in good alignment. Um, over time, as we drive for hours, we can lose that scapula strength and we start, our shoulders start rolling a bit and causing um, impingement in an already crowded space. Um, we wanted to create a, a movement that actually opens up that space and strengthens the scapula to help reinforce our posture and help us do our job better longer. All right, let's do this truck driver's steering wheel pull. I really want us to claim this and uh, we really hope it helps drivers. So get your resistance band. You can find them around Amazon, get creative, uh, loop it around your steering wheel for stability. All right. Um, telescope your steering wheel up and out. You want your seat lowered and you want it back. Now you want to kind of sit on the edge of your seat towards the middle. So you don't left hand doesn't hit the window or the, or the um, curtains. All right, so first thing we want to do is compress down your shoulders and not have shoulder elevation like as a shrug. We don't want that. We want to compress them down. Very good. Now, Tammy's going to do it without the band right now because we're going to show you. What scapular retraction is, is when your shoulder blades move closer to your spine. Um, this contracts our muscles in, in this scapula area, which is, we got four uh, rotator cuff muscles, which are in black. We have our rear delt, we have our rhomboid, and we have our teres major that connect as well to the shoulder blade. As we do this truck driver steering wheel pull, we are hitting all and contracting all those muscles. So, Tammy's going to demonstrate it. So as she pulls her hands back and out, she's, she's retracting. Now, we're not doing a row. A row would be pulling your elbows back, and that would work your lat muscles mainly. But what we want to do is we want our hands to pull and kind of go out and as you can see, you get killer retraction on the back and upper muscles. Great job. All right, so if you don't have a resistance band and you can't really do that last exercise, we have a great variation. If you have an upper bunk or maybe a pull-up bar, this next exercise is gonna be great for also strengthening the scapula muscles. We're calling it the Headbangers Pull-Up. Check it out. Pull-ups are great for strengthening our upper back with an additional benefit of traction on our spine, which can help with back pain. The headbanger part of this exercise is where the scapula retraction really comes into play. In whole, this exercise forces you to hold yourself in the air with not just your hands, but the scapula muscles as well.
We hope you found this video helpful. And uh, we want to encourage you to look into getting some resistance bands. Um, if you follow our videos, you notice that we really incorporate resistance bands in our workouts. Yeah, and take the journey with us by subscribing to our channel. Click the subscribe button. And hit that bell and never miss a workout. Ding. See you then.